Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Fallout 1.5 Resurrection. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that you chose to join me today after last episode where we finally got to see and understand a little bit more, or a whole lot more actually, of what drives the ghouls that are attacking apparently everybody around here. Let's have a chat here with Durna, see if he says anything new. Um, yeah man, you, you talk to the ghouls, so, um, is, you know what's going on here. Are you going to do something about it? Oh, that's not our fight, he says. No super mutant will ever fight for the salvation of the humankind, even if the threat of their destruction comes from such an absurd reason. It is up to them if they succumb to this or some other threat, or if they'll destroy themselves in the future. Well, yeah, okay. So, bye, I guess? Can't really fix you. Oh, pre press A. It's not a problem. Nobody's trying to fight us. Pressed A as I was trying to move to the side, and uh, no. It's all good. Everything is 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 good to go, and uh, we're getting out of here. Sorry, what's your name? Uh, List oh, Lystra is overloaded. Lystra, come on. What's up with her? Why is she overloaded? That's the... Okay, so have, let's have a chat with her. Um, Show me what you're carrying. I need to go into combat control to know what exactly is going on. I'm going to get that one. I'm gonna get that one. We're gonna need to sell a bunch of this crap. We're probably gonna just drop it or something. Uh, let's see. So you have plenty of those. Give me just one. And let's see if she's still overloaded. She should, shouldn't should be able to carry too much stuff after she's overloaded. Or after she goes above her, um, her quota. Damn it. Run, woman. Run. No, she's still overloaded. Okay, well, it doesn't matter. It's, it's all good. Uh, so, yeah. I have no idea how the world map looks. Um... Let's find out. Toward the bottom edge. Oh, rebirth based that way. Okay. Well, we have a lot of stuff to do still. Um, so let's see if we've got all the locations. We don't have all the locations. There's one still missing. But I don't want to go to the end of the game. Because um, I want to do the quest and all that sort of stuff. So let's not do that. Let's continue exploring, going around. Let's see what happened in Albuquerque. Because it, it might be that, um, that everything has gone to shit. Because... We killed the leader of the of the mutant hunters, and, uh, well, hopefully nothing has gone to shit, but I guess we'll see. I guess we'll find out. Come on. No, go no ghouls? No ghouls. There we go. That was pretty good. So, the suburbs. Let's start out with that. Uh, let's get in here. Also, somebody told me in the comments that the shaman is supposed to give me uh, a trait or a, or a stat uh, if I'm good but or if I'm bad. Hey, before outsiders leave... Uh, before outsider leaves, he says, Rua must ask him something. A girl named Aaliyah has ran away from the tribe not long ago. Rua has heard that outsider was talking to her. Does he know where she went? Uh, well, whatever she went, I'm sure she had a good reason to. Bye bye. Yeah, it doesn't really do anything. Whatever. It's fine. It's all good. It's a good thing that he replied to me or the uh, engaged me on that particular conversation. But apart from that. Everything is as it should be. I now have power armor, of course, and we need power armor. We need stuff to give to Lystra and carry, unless we don't bring them. Um, I don't think I'm going to need the, all this crap that I'm carrying right now, to be honest. I'm going to buy a bunch of stuff, like Rad Axe, for example. Uh, I'm going to get that. Psycho would be pretty good as well. Uh, let's get those. Let's see. I'm going to bring... Uh, right away. Sure, go right ahead. And uh, that's going to be that. Okay, I'm going to give him... These are probably going to be expensive. Yeah, of course they are. Okay, give him that, give him that, don't need that one. Grenades are not going to be used. These are definitely not going to be used. They, let's see, so this uh, hollow disc, mm, leather armor. I think Lystra is wearing already uh, metal armor, I think. And there we go, that's almost what I wanted. Or in terms of money, anyway. Let's see if I can get something else here that will uh, benefit me. But probably not. Get the money. But... Let's see. Get that as well. Oh, that's expensive. Damn it. Do I have... How much ammo do oh, I have? plenty of ammo. I, 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 yeah, I'm going to buy another one. Why not? Uh, and also, let's sell... Let's see if I have something here that could be sold. I still need to read that book. Probably don't have anything here. Eh. Dang it. Okay, what about that one? Yeah, whatever. Doesn't matter. Just sell it. We don't need the money. We're, we're fine. We're fine. So, see you later. Uh, let's see what I got. So, I got this holodisc that... Uh, wait a minute. This is the thing for... Okay, so this is for the mutant hunters and they know... And maybe I could talk to the Imperial City about this. Maybe. So, I killed Vex and uh, I took care of that. Does William... 
uh, yeah, so basically I, I went ahead and talked to Willem. Okay, so that particular quest is done. Uh, let's not go there. Let's talk to the uh, to the hospital because there were a, there was a quest for the wa the hospital. I think somebody want there wanted us to help out or something. I don't really know. I'm gonna need to remove some stuff from from Lister's inventory. As soon as you enter the dead quarter, you are surrounded by a group of armed men. The runt Benicio steps right. Oh, this is the guy. The guy that was running away. I think no, was it? Uh, no, it was the little guy. Oh, the, yeah, the small guy. Um, the dwarf. I mean, looks like this is the end for you. He says you picked the wrong side. Had you listened to me back in the wild paradise, things might have turned out differently, but it's too late for that now. Nobody kills our provider and gets away with it. That's why you must die. Any last words? Well, this would be an easy choice because I don't really think that I'm, I'm going to be given a second chance, but let's go with that one. No choice. Eliza already got what she deserves. Now it's your turn. And I think I'm going to be shot. For 15 points of damage. That is pretty good. Who is fighting me? Mmm, well, let's see what I can do here. So I got that one. And, uh, let's see what they have. So, this guy's got a sniper rifle. That girl has got, uh, hmm. She doesn't have anything. This guy doesn't have anything. Uh, so they basically kill her for hire. This guy doesn't have anything. So I'm gonna try, she's gonna, yeah, I'm gonna need to kill that guy because he shot me. So let's move. Oh, a critical causing some serious pain. Okay. Hopefully my power armor is going to protect me. That was a critical for 4 damage. A lot of these attacks are probably going to be no damage. Hopefully going to be no damage. 1 point of damage. Oh, that's scary. Good. And that's Lystra. Oh, he died. The poor little guy died. Oh, don't attack my men. Or women. Okay. Damn it. 13 points for carry. And, yeah. So this is... Oh. Hmm... Okay, that's not as good. Lister just took 28. I need to kill that guy. Lister, please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. Okay. I, I think she's gonna survive. I th Why can't I attack? Are you kidding me? Why am I not involved in this fight? I have a save before, but... Why? Seriously? Are you kidding me right now? Let's get out of here. You guys are lame. Okay, let's reload here. Reload. There we go. Heal up everybody. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that's also something I need to buy is stim packs. So, heal myself. That's going to be up to 10, 10 hit points. Just amazing, isn't it? Just brilliant and amazing. Okay, so let's actually do something different here. Let's do it like this. Put it there. So, my hit points, I'm 12 away. I can eat some apples or a single apple. Let's see what that gives me. One, probably. Four. That was pretty good. Uh, okay, so she needs some healing for sure. So she is at uh, 26 out of 82. Let's go with a 1, a 2, and a 3. And she's now at 70 out of 82. And she needs, let's see, so she is at, oh man, 27 out of 101. That's pretty bad. So that should be about 50. That should be about enough right there. Oh, that was more than enough. Okay. Let's get going. I might not... Hello? Okay, yeah. Just attack me, guys. Attack me. Okay, so these guys are a problem. Uh, like, that guy's got a... That guy, for example, he's got a combat shotgun, so he needs to die. Or be blinded. He didn't... Wasn't blinded, so let's move on top of these guys. Hopefully they will shoot me rather than my friends, because I can heal myself, and I can also protect myself. Especially from attacks like those. Yeah, that's what you get. Okay. No, please don't. That's that hasn't cost me any action action points. That was a scream, but 13 points of damage. I'm still being shot at. Oh, that was a oh that okay, I'm back. I'm back. Okay, so that guy needs to die. I try and kill him. And that was a kill. Mm-hmm. Okay, so this might not go too well, guys. This might not go too well at all. Eight action eight steam packs. It's a tough battle. It's a tough battle. Please use burst. Okay. 13 and 13. That's manageable. Please don't do those. The melee guys, they're they're powerful. That was uh, 15 points of damage on a single melee attack. I'm going to try and go with a burst here. If I score a critical, these guys are going to have a bad time. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I don't see this going too well, though, to be honest. I'm, gonna ne I'm probably going to need to... 
Oh, that wasn't what I meant for ha for it to happen. Yeah. Man, these guys... I'm, I'm going to need to leave them back and just do this on my own and bail and stuff like that. They can't manage to kill us. Oh, she's running away already. She's going to die. Okay. Well, it seems that uh, I'm going to need to reload. Because as soon as she dies, that's that game over for me because they have... They get uh, an extra turn. Although she might survive. I No, I might not. So yeah. Okay. Well, let's see. I got to fix this. Don't worry. It's all good. So I just bought the fix for that. It's all perfectly fine. Now that I know what to expect, I'm going to load that save right there. Uh, secondly... So, uh, I'm gonna need to get you... Hey, uh, wait here until I return. Yep, just wait here. And where the hell's Lystra? I know you're overloaded. Come back here. Uh, just come back. Can I, can I trade with her? I can't. Okay, a little longer. Come on, Lystra. I wanted you to be up here. Okay, whatever you say. So, wait here until I return. Okay, perfect. And now... Now for the party trick. I'm just gonna save the game here. I'm gonna go with the temp save. Just in case something terrible happens. Uh, and uh, for the party trick, I'm gonna take some drugs. Psycho. This thing is amazing. Especially against these guys. Because the power armor... Where's my resistance? Uh, there it is. The power armor protects only 40% against normal. It's very good against laser, but that's pretty much it. Everything else is kind of reasonably okay. And uh, my constitution is not good enough. I'm still level 9, so that makes sense. Um, uh, I have no idea if the game is gonna last too much longer, I don't think it is, but, uh, well, I would like it to be, but to, to last for a little while longer, but apparently that's, that might not be the case. So we might never get the chance to, to have too high health, which is a pretty big problem, to be honest, because all the enemies have pretty, pretty high health. So what the Psycho is gonna do, is it's gonna allow me to withstand a little bit more damage. Also, I've just become an addict, which is gonna be a little bit of an issue, so I'm gonna try and not become an addict, please. That, that'd be a, a particularly good thing to happen. Please don't. This thing actually, I think, has a 20% chance for you to become an addict. And look at that. 90% normal damage resistance. Yep. So we're gonna kick some ass. We're just gonna basically destroy and murder these guys. Okay, I would crack my knuckles, but um, I, I don't like doing that when I don't need it. Four points of damage there. Okay, so we need to kill guys. Let's see, this guy's not gonna be an issue. I don't think I am going to need to kill the guy with the sniper rifle. That's going to be that guy. So let's go for the head. And just send him down as one at a time. Okay. And that was a shot for three points of damage. As you can tell, very, very, very low damage that we're taking. That guy has a nice weapon. Whatever the guy has, the small, the, the dwarf dude. I forget his name. Benichu, I think. Whatever he has, it is pretty powerful. Ouch. Would you please not? Now I die? No, I don't. Um, the, 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 so let's see. I am going to go with a normal... Actually, you know what? I'm not going to go with anything. I'm just going to heal up in here. Uh, and uh, yeah, just use that. However many I need. Because it uses four action points to, uh, to open the inventory. And that's 55. That's good enough. And let's go this way. And try and avoid these big guys with the sledgehammers, because those are going to be a little bit of a pain in the ass. That critical must have been terribly, terribly powerful, but sometimes that happens. I don't... I think it's... Yeah, I think it's the bypassing the armor that doesn't count into Psycho. Because I remember the first time I used Psycho was on camera when while playing Fallout 2. I'd never used it before. Uh, and uh, the first time I, I did it, um, it... There, sometimes I would die. That's what you get, little guy. Sometimes I would die with a single hit because the, the criticals bypass the armor. So it's not a sure thing, the fact that I have so much damage resistance. Uh, and certainly at any time I can die, which is a problem. This is the thing. Th so low health, it's... Yeah, it is a problem. So these guys got an assault rifle. That's not going to be too much of an issue. That combat shotgun is. But this combat shotgun is going to be a little bit more of an issue. I'm going to take another stim pack and continue moving away. Of course, nobody helps me in this fight. Which is a big, big problem. But, uh, well, it's not a problem because I decided against it. Against everybody. Uh, having er having people help me out. Namely, Carrie and uh, Lystra. That was one damage. That was a miss. Okay, so we're, we should be okay. Three points of damage. That's a nice hit. That was 30 points. Of, that's if, it, if I'm resisting... T uh, if I'm taking only 10%. Oh, he's got a Ripper. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, let's see what I can do here to your eyes. 
Uh, nope, causing serious pain, but no kill. Yeah, I need I need a critical, a nice critical as well. I think I have the better criticals as well. So next turn, I'm gonna take a shot and uh, reload, or I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll find out if I'm gonna need to reload or. Okay, that guy's back up. Hmm. Okay, let's not reload. Let's start using this thing because it's gonna be a little bit better here. Let's murder this in the face. And hmm. That uh, 33? Was it 33? Yep. Yeah. Uh, he come up to the ground, but didn't really kill him. So no reloads, no anything. Just keep moving. And uh, keep keeping a distance between us and them. That guy has decided to go around. That guy's taking steam packs, which is a problem. I think he might be running away as well. No, he's not, actually. What he's doing right there is uh, they can't get past that guy because there's a tub. And that is actually going to play into my hands. So I'm going to take a shot here. Oh, sweet, sweet, beautiful, beautiful noise that that makes. Okay, I'm gonna stay back here. That guy's gonna shoot me. So they're gonna take their time. Ouch, that was a burst there. One hit point, though, taken. And now a grenade would be a good thing, but I, I'm terrible with throwing. So I can't really do anything. I think grenades are really important in this mod pack. Or I say mod pack, but it's in this mod. Which is a fantastic thing. That is a really, really good thing. Uh, the, the grenades were never really important in previous games, and they actually they were actually actively awful to use because of the AOE thing and all that sort of stuff. You, you, you'd usually just murder yourself or your teammates. That guy just took 16 hit points of damage. And I just take, took one. Yeah, the psycho was working. Uh, I didn't want to didn't want to become... Uh, if I knew the game, I probably would be fine with becoming addicted. Okay, this guy's got the sniper rifle. That is another... That was just lovely. Um... I would be fine with becoming addicted. I would just take it a few more often and or before every combat, probably. We're probably going to need to take it anyway, but I don't know how long the, the game is going to last, so it's kind of shot in the dark, and I didn't want to screw up the, the Let's Play. Although it can be fun to become addicted sometimes in, in Fallout. Not in real life, though, I, I don't think. So, okay, so... Hmm. Oh, there's something... You see that? You see that? What I'm seeing right now? To the right side of my screen? Right now? Do you see that? This. What is that? I don't remember that. What does she have? Oh, she's got a 14 millimeter pistol that she needs to be taken care of. Okay, so she is... Oh, she just has serious pain. She doesn't have... Let's take another one. Uh, she doesn't have the... Uh, blindness. Yeah, I, I think it's going well. The psycho here is going to work in our favor. And not having our teammates is going to be basically... Uh, although, yeah, basically from now on, as things stand, either we're gonna accept that they die, or we're gonna just use them as mules. Uh, and which might be the case, actually. Let's see, let's take her out. And there we go, and I'll fall up here, if I'm lucky. Yeah, there we go, That the first guy was not the first one to go. He's reloading, he's gonna shoot. Oh, he didn't... Hello, how's it going, man? How's it going? Oh, I just missed the 95. It's not too often that happens, that's a good thing. It's a good thing. Not playing on hard, so that doesn't happen too often. 26 hit points of damage. That just happened. Uh, well, I can take... I'm not gonna take anything. You know what? I'm just gonna go into my inventory. Heal up a little bit. Not gonna risk anything. We can buy stim packs if we need to, and we're probably gonna be able to buy a few here in the hospital anyway, so I'm gonna just take th three of them. And uh, anyway, it's better. it's better than what was happening before, so it's all good. Uh, let's see, so I got that one over there, all done, and I got this one over there, all and done. There we go, okay, so now we can continue moving. I don't really know where they are, okay. That's nice. <coughs> Mercenaries with, was hit instead of me, yeah, he needs to die. Actually, from here, I think the best course of action is hope for a murder of three guys. Oh, they didn't kill him? Come on. Okay. No, nice. Don't kill the, the, the guys at the hospital. I don't think they will take too kindly to that. But here I am with a few bursts. Oh, it's not working. It's just 8 and 7. That's not bad damage, but it's not good damage either. So there's nobody protecting this place. It's good, so I can continue using my burst. Just hit that guy instead of the other guy for 11. No, I actually hit two guys. 11 eight, and 18. It's not too bad. Oh, now you've done it. Now you've done it. Ah, yeah. He's going down. I hope I don't level up, though, because we don't have our friends here. Let's see. Let's, I will open my character. Oh, they're fighting. They're, they're all m mobilized. 
So, yeah, I'm going to level up, and my teammates are not going to be here. It's going to be a problem. That is going to be a problem. But I don't care for that too much. That guy just died. I didn't see how high his health was. But hopefully they're going to stop because they were only fighting against him. Although that doesn't really... Okay. Oh, they're coming. Oh, they're coming. Hope they go back to their places after this, by the way. Okay. Don't kill them. I want to kill them. Oh, they hit beneath you instead of the mercenary. Oh, the money beneath you is dead. I think. Down he goes. And I level up. They don't go. They don't go back to their places. Come on, really? Okay, whatever you say. Let's have a chat with them. And hey, yeah, let's go. You as well, overcumbered, overencumbered Lystra. Come on. Yeah, fourteen hundred experience gained, and they didn't level up. That's sad. That's a problem. Eh, whatever. They might. They might not need to. Uh, so let's see, we need... Oh, small guns has been increased. When has it been increased? Did I read something? Did I train? Was it the memory or something? Oh, wait a minute. The, s the sense has gone down as well. Oh, it... Yeah, sure. It's the it's the Psycho's effect. Psycho has some, um, some effects, some additional effects apart from just the thing. What's the... Uh, where's that? Where, damn it. Where the hell is the Psycho? There it is. Uh, it has increases combat to potential. Oh, yeah, it doesn't really. Yeah, basically that's how it goes. So let's get whatever's in the corpses, cause uh, that's what we came here for. Mostly, You're just uh, killing guys and taking taking ammo. So we got a reaper here. That's pretty good. We got some psycho as well. Let's see more psycho. These guys have plenty of it. That's nice. Also some steam packs, which is pretty cool as well. Let's see what do we have over here. The 10 millimeter pistol that we have already. The what we have over here. Uh, combat shotgun, then of course we have already. And ooh, another one of these that we have already as well. So we definitely didn't need to, to, to buy the stuff. It's gone. It's gone. That part of the game where you just need to scavenge and earn money and all that sort of stuff. It is gone. As I expected it to be, really. Uh, it's it, wasn't, it wouldn't last for too long, I'm sure. So there we go. We have killed those who meant to, to kill us. So let's see if I... Oh. Oh, you tis you! Come on! Oh, how do you get there? I wanna get there! Hey, sir, are you a children of the cathedral? A child of the cathedral? You hungry? Puss sell... Uh, oh, his, his name is Puss? Puss? Uh, pool sells... R sell roasted meat. Only five bottle caps is a piece. Puss meat is cheap and tasty. Puss? Yeah, everyone call Pugs Puss. He points to the stomach turning pimple on his face. Oh, puss. Puss, puss. But Puss don't mind. He roasts meat slices and people pay. Puss happy with life. Really? Okay. Um, did you have a doctor take a look at that pimple? You could check your head as well while you're at it. Puss not know what you mean. Head not hurt. Puss not have so many bottle caps to go to hospital. Puss don't mind pimple on face. Just must not scratch too often. Yeah. So, you know what? Better tell me where you get that meat from and how you prepare it. No person asked Puss this before. You really interested? Yeah, of course I'm interested. Take it from the beginning. Where you get the meat from? How you prepare it? Puss buy from hospital. Doctors sell cheap when they don't need any more. Puss cut meat into tiny pieces. Must select carefully. Throw away what don't eat. Like needles, sutures, wires. Oh, slow down there. You, you want to say that this is human flesh? Don't be silly. Hospital, no treat the animals. Just imagine... <laughs> that is funny. Of course it is human meat. Doctors work with bodies of different things. When something left over, they say, of no use, they sell to meat to pus. So what do you do with the meat from the hospital afterwards? Then pus find things that burn. He put them in, in his barrel to make fire, put roast meat on fire, meat much more tastier than raw. That is why people buy from pus. So you want to say you're roast on anything that burns? Pus discovered that some things make meat taste different. Tires can taste a lot. Uh, bu but Puss cannot be picky. Puss think it is still better than raw meat. Oh, so you have many customers? People came to see Puss come with a growing st growling stomach and five bottle caps. Give caps to Puss and eat. Everybody happy. Okay. This must end. Puss die now. Are we gonna do this? Otto is a jackass. So, no. Let him do his thing. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. Just let him kill people with uh, human meat. Oh, boy. Yeah. Well, I, I think it's 
I, I'm not really sure. I think if you eat human, be eat human meat, you get uh, the mad cow's disease or something like that. Uh, or is it only if it's raw? I don't really know. But it's a, it's a real thing. It, it, it degenerates the brain or something. There's like a thing that genetically thing just doesn't work or something. I'm not really sure how it, it goes. I could read up on that, but it's not really something that I am interested in reading, to be honest. Ugh. I prefer pork. Or cow... What's the name of cow meat? Mm, beef. Beef. I prefer beef and pork. Or chicken. That's also nice. Uh, but, yeah, well, any sort of meat, really. Except for human. Please don't... No. Uh, okay, so let's see what we have here. I didn't come this way before. Little junkie. We got a little junkie here. Let's see if the little junkie has anything to say. Blah. He says, uh, these hunters give me the crypts. Yeah, that's right. We need to go there and check them out. Let's do the... Oh, but I, I want to check out the hospital first because the hunters might need want to kill me or something. Need to kill me? That's not a thing that they need to, but they might want to. So let's see. Down here, this is where we came first, where we blowed up the door. Up there, we got, I think, a wall that we needed. We still haven't explored the Imperial City. That's going to take a while because I think that's going to be a lot of people in there. Excuse the hiccup. Um... But uh, it's gonna it's gonna be fine because the quests and all that sort of stuff. It's kind of funny. The first the first people I actually talked to in there, or that's actually maybe that's a, a com confirmation bias or something. Not confirmation bias, but y you know what I mean. Maybe just uh, me being seeing it wrong. But I thought I I have the impression that the first the only people that I talked to in there just gave me a quest right away, and uh, that's not really the case. So we have been down there. Oh, we just opened this. Nice, nice, nice. I'm getting a little bit more proficient with this. Oh, no, wait a minute. I locked the door. Dang it. Just open the door. Okay. I hate it when that happens. And sometimes you can't open the door. Uh, because you locked it too well. That has happened to me. The first time I locked the door by accident, I that happened to me. The first, the very first time. And it has stuck with me for years now. Because that was a long, long time ago. And this is where we got to meet... Mm, the new emperor of the city or something? I'm not really sure who we, what his name was, but there's nothing down here for us. Uh, and, uh, yeah, that, that, that encounter could have gone a few different ways, depending on how we chose to interact with the guy. So, I'm, I'm happy it went that way. I'm really glad it did. So, let's go to the hospital. Let's find out what these guys want, or at least get in there. Because we're running out of time, just look at my second screen. And the reason why I wanted these guys to uh, change their positions is because I don't really know who they are. So, I... I'm not a doctor, he says. Okay, so it's it's good. Let's go ahead and just... What the hell are you doing in there? How did you get in here? Oh, she came in from the north. Okay, let's see if there's anybody around. Hello, there's a doctor here. Ah, a customer. Welcome. He smiles like a cat that just caught a mouse. I'm a doctor... F oh, a cat that just caught a mouse doesn't smile. What? Is that a saying? i never heard of that, but I've seen cats... Caught, caught, catching mouses or mice and they, they don't smile, they, they growl at you and they don't like you. But anyway, I'm a doctor I'm Dr. Falbel, Fal Falber the head of this hospital. What can I do for you? Well, uh, what do you offer in this hospital besides healing? Our greatest interest lies in, in improving human abilities. Not only are we constantly researching the methods to achieve this, but now we are even able to make people stronger, tougher, quicker, smarter, more perceptive, as well as attractive by performing minor surgical procedures and transplanting higher quality organs. A noticeable improvement by, shall we say, one degree. Since it is hard for the human body to accept and make use of organs that are too powerful, you can only undergo each of these operations once. And I'm sure I don't have to tell you that you are quite they are quite expensive. Oh, really? Well, I guess we're going to find out next episode. For now, though, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Fallout 1.5 Resurrection. I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.